Do you think more people should try, especially people that are suffering from treatment resistant depression or other things or struggling in their lives, should try things like psilocybin, which is the active compound in magic mushrooms? Uh, generally speaking, no. And there's a really important reason for that. So all these things, so the number of people who have been, that I've seen in my office who have been messed up by psychedelics far outweighs the number of people who've been helped. Really? Yes. Six months ago, I used psychedelics and now like I'm having panic attacks. Here's the key thing to understand. Psychedelics, what we know scientifically, forget about all the, whether the beings exist or not, whatever, Dr. K is crazy. What we know is that they induce neuroplasticity. Now here's the problem. Neuroplasticity means my brain is in edit mode, okay? Which means that if you edit it in the wrong way, you'll mess up your brain. So what we know is that this is what's really interesting. If we look at the therapeutic effects of psychedelics, set and setting matter a lot. You need to have like people with you who can like shepherd you through the journey because if you just do it on your own, you'll potentially get worse. And unfortunately, what I've seen is I've had plenty of patients who will like experiment with it when they're feeling really bad because they hear it as healing. But it just messes them up even more because now they're just going in, they're editing, they have a traumatic experience, some demon is there, it's hounding them, they can't escape. They like wake up from the trip and they're like the demon is like there when they close their eyes and like all kinds of weird stuff. So I think you ha it has to be done in the right way, which the studies also support. That psychedelic, it's not, you just take psilocybin and you're healed. What happens is you'll have a trial that has 13 weeks of therapy with two doses of psychedelics in the middle. And one really important part is after the psychedelic, the therapist will talk to you about integrating what you learned into your life. Now that you've had this experience of a vastness of self and you feel connected with other people, what are you gonna do about this divorce that you're going through? So I think there's elements that make it clinically useful. There are elements that can heal, but you need shepherding. So you're pro-psychedelics, but in the context where it's guided with a, a trained professional and the set and setting is controlled, I would say that I am optimi cautiously optimistic about psychedelics. And if we want to talk about their benefits, we need to pay attention to the way in which the trials are conducted and the traditions in which they're conducted.